Oop. Hey Tark, hello. Have you played Spirit Farm? Have you been, by the way? Today we'll be picking up Spirit Farm. It's a very nice, calming game. And. I'm really looking forward to experiencing the story firsthand. I haven't seen too much of it. New game. on the bottom right. thought for a second, you would never wake up, little one. How ironic that would have been, would it not? I'm Karen. Here's a Sharon. The spirit fairy. Well, that is what I have been until your arrival. I cannot say that I am sad to leave. But I still had a few things left to do here. I'm afraid you will have to pick up things where I left them. It is, after all, my very last day. And you are... Stella. Stella. Welcome, Stella. I see you've brought your friend here with you. What's his name? Daffodil. Daffodil. I see. You two will share the burden then. And take it over from me. As I said, in a few minutes, I will be gone from this world. And that is why you are here. You will be the new spirit fairy. Listen. No, my phone! <laughs> Listen, your task here will be far from easy, but simple nonetheless. Let me, let me mute that. <laughs> let me mute that for now. Sorry. Other thing too. Off. Off, I see. There we go. And we're back. Go fetch the stray spirits stranded on the islands, and when they are ready. Bring them back here. 
dying souls can't pass away on their own. You will have to help them fulfill their last requests and be at their service until their last breath. The big brown bridge over there is the Everdorn. The Alpha, where everything starts. The Omega, where everything ends. This is where all the quests get completed and where existence meets its threshold. There is no task more important than this one. Never forget this, Stella. Here. There is something I need to give you. Now, be really careful with it. It is the Everlight. The symbol of your status here, and the only tool you will ever need. Wait, what are you... Oh, how highly inappropriate. <laughs> oh, the little cat. Well, that settles it. The Everlight will help you through your travels. It will be the light that shines in the darkness, the last remaining hope of the departed. turned into a little collar. Hope is a flame, the light that never falters, the beacon of eternity. It is heavy and inconvenient, but there is no greater duty than this one. The fate of lost souls rests on your shoulders. Look, I was overwhelmed too at first. Just try to keep your focus. Take it one step at a time. You will soon get used to this place. Accustomed to these moments. You are the new spared fairies after all. Once I am gone, you will have to find a ship of your own. Mine is not suited for you and it will fade away once I am gone. You might find one not too far from here, if you keep rowing in the right direction for some time. Probably. It's time. Here I go. So long, Stella. And good luck. You will need it. <laughs> up, up, up. Alright, where do we need to go? Oh. Oh. Hold on, give me a second. My headset seems to have disconnected. Why is that? Why did it disconnect? Strange. Alright, got it back. Hold up while jumping to climb three platforms. Nice. Whoop. Whoop. Hold down and X to drop down. Oh, is he a stag? Press square to interact with the glowing outline. 
Stella! It really is you. Stand up straight and let me get a look at you. Mm. You look good. Hello, hello, just Josuke. How are you doing? I'm doing alright. We just started with Spirit Fair. Welcome to the stream, by the way. You look good. And Daffodil is here too, I see. Mm. We'll have to find a lint roller then. Ah. Uh, it might not be that obvious after all. I'm pretty good just working at the moment. Ah, okay, okay, okay. I hope work goes well for you. Mm. It's me, Gwen. Good thing you found me. Mm. But if you're here, it means... Oh. You are the new spirit fair. Mm. You are the one replacing Sharon. I was trying to get rid of him, and only ended up here by accident. I've been stuck on this disgusting island for about a week, living off sardines and cigarettes. Mm. Funny how I used to be the one getting you out of trouble before. I can see you have an Everlight now. Mm. Of course. See that boat over there? That rundown boat over there. Mm -hmm. That's the one. Mm -hmm. It's obviously slightly shabby, but let's commandeer it. I've got my cup of tea, so it should be okay. Nice, very nice. What kind of tea do you prefer? I'm more of a coffee person myself. I'd wager it'll work. Since you're the spirit fair. Okay. Meet me on the deck over there. Mm -hmm. I'll explain it all. Choo. 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 Over here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Here goes. Hope my fur coat won't be too damaged. Hmm. I like to switch it up, but today I've got black tea with cinnamon. Ooh, I can't remember what the last tea I tried was. Actually, the only time I really drink tea is when I'm really, <laughs> when I'm really sick, and I'd like to clear my, um, I'd like something soothing for my throat and something to clear my nose. But yeah, tea can be really nice sometimes. Wonderful. I'm not one to jump for joy, but this feels good. Much better than anticipated. So, the way I see it, this boat is yours now. Don't you think? Good. And as you're the spirit fire, welcoming stray spirits is your new job. And once aboard, they will assume their true forms. As you have. I don't drink coffee since I don't like the taste, so tea is my go-to if I need a bit of caffeine. I found that the caffeine in tea doesn't really do anything for me. Not as effective. But yeah, I can understand why uh, people wouldn't like coffee. It's kind of bitter. Kind of a strong taste to it. Mm -hmm. Well, it's my theory anyway. Why are you looking at me like that? Mm. You need to come here and give me a hug. Personal connection. What's that? How do I... Square? Oh. Hug. Mm. Aww. Mm. Mm. Much better. Come with me now. 
Let's take a look at this chaos. That's fair. From what I've heard, once you start with coffee, tea does nothing. Yeah! <laughs> I kind of figured that out. Back. Sorry to chat, but update. Uh, welcome back. Yes, so recently I've been getting bombarded by a ton of ads from Twitch about Christmas. And it's basically like promoting their users to gift subs and stuff like that. And it's kind of off-putting to me. I don't like it. I really don't like it. Oh no! What a mess. Reminds me of Aunt Petunia's old yard. A beautiful, unorganized testament to someone's laziness. Or a vital impossibility to get rid of anything. At any rate, we should do something about this, or my dust allergies will be back. Let me think. Mm -hmm. There's only one way to clean this up. You have to meet Albert. Mm -hmm. He's your local shipwright. And his jokes are garbage. But he is the only one who can fix your boat. Mm -hmm. We should head to Albert's shipyard. He must be wondering how to make the ship move. Mm. It's really easy, actually. There. Let me give you this key I found on the island. It'll unlock the cabin in the back. Mm -hmm. You should find a map projector in there. How does she know all of this? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I... Yes, how do you know all of this? Well, I was planning an escape, remember? Mm -hmm. And you know me. I plan things meticulously. Oh, that was excellent timing. <laughs> I just, I don't know. This is pure coincidence. It doesn't uh, really seem very in the Christmas spirit to just encourage people to spend money. Yeah, I know. It's so... Oh. It bothers me. Because, like, I like going into a game category that I like and then swapping to people's streams to see what's going on and chatting with new people and stuff like that. But it's hard to do that when I have to wait a minute at a time to do that. Capitalism be like that? Yeah. Unfortunately. I plan things meticulously. Very mm -hmm. meticulously. Go. Open up that cabin, Stella. Mm -hmm. The map projector should be simple enough to use. And you just have to go to Albert Shipyard. Bump. 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 Yep. 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 I like the animations, the movement. Very fluid. Twitch has to make money to run. Yeah, pretty much. Um, what's this bell? Ding dong. Ding dong. Ding dong. <laughs> Is there a way to get to that bed from in here? I don't square. Oh, it's locked. Oh, we have a key. Yeah. Oh, we can get to it. Nice. All right. Is this the map thing? Oh, harbor. And then we're going over here. All the shipyard. What's this? Oh, it's the gate. The Evador. And there's a little TV thing. What is that? What is that? Huh. It's where we are, I guess. And this is where we need to go. 
confirm channel. And the way it's going, I think it's going to do a mixer. What do you mean? What do you mean? I wasn't following mixer too much, so I don't know. It's a bus stop, but you won't get access to that until later. Ah, oh, okay, okay. Can I go outside? Can we watch the ship move? Stella! Yes. Hey. As I understand, the ship is powered by your Everlight. That's how it cruises the ocean and reveals the stray spirits. It also explains why I couldn't do anything by myself. Hmm. You must admit, it's quite fascinating. Look, I know you must feel overwhelmed. Hey. Sharon, the Evador. The spirit fairs, this place, this boat, me being here, it's a lot. You must be wondering what's going on. Mm -hmm. Truth be told, I don't really know either. But I'm here for you. I'll do my best to help you and try to make sense of it all. Mm -hmm. As I said earlier, I wanted to leave by myself, but somehow, I just couldn't. Now that I see you, I think I know why. I'll give you some space for now. Don't hesitate to explore this ship. Mm -hmm. We can even give that fishing route a try. Fishing? Fishing, you say? The world is your oyster. Fishing? Where? Fish. Fish, fish, fish. I don't see... A fishing rod. Where? Where would it be? Is it this? It is this! Ooh. How do we use it? Huh. Huh. Hold to real, hold to real! Yay! We got a herring. Nice. Okay, let me... Here we are. Hobbit shipyard discovered. Now head down to Albert Shipyard and upgrade your blueprint station. It's the only way to clear this cutter. I'm curious about what it's all made of. Hey. Considering the smell, I'd say at least seven different types of dirt and dust. You can tell that from the smell. I want to know what this couch does. It's highlighted. Oh, you just sit there. Aww. Aww. Okay. He's a shark. Same. Is he the ship, right? Over here. Welcome to my shipyard, young traveler. Where my prices are a customer's best friend. I'm Albert. Been in the business of shipbuilding for ages. Should I assume you're the new uh, spirit fair? Well, of course you are. Anyway, you've been able to start this ship and bring it here after all. Gwen was right to point you towards my humble enterprise. That's right, Gwen. That's her name. <laughs> I. Sorry, Gwen. I'll remember it now. Gwen. Ha! Huh. Let me see what you have here. Nice little dinghy. Funny how it looks exactly like the, the one I'd built some time ago and stored in my old shipyard. Ha! <laughs> Funny! Yeah. Uh, pure coincidence. See, Sharon was unhappy about his gloomy and dang art. Actually, he was always complaining about everything. But the customer's always right. So I built him a newer, better one. Of course, he would never abandon his previous boat. That tiny one? Old habits die hard. Okay, my headset die disconnected for a second time. I'm gonna I'm gonna swap it to my other one. I'm not sure if it's because it's not charged properly or 
completes the connection? I don't know. It'll only take a second. Bum, bum. And connected. Super loud too. Hold on. There we go. Old habits die hard. But don't worry, you can keep this one. Let's just call this a loan. He's a loan shark! <laughs> and let me tell you something. You know we always joke about the construction here. Don't worry. We're still working on it. <laughs> anyway, with a, little bit of, with a little bit of love, this bird will be resplendent again. The first thing you'll need is the proper blueprint table. Since it's your lucky day and I'm feeling generous, I'll offer it to you. Free of charge! Mind you, it's just a bit of bare bones in terms of functionality. But the subsequent upgrades will come at such a small price, you'll want to buy them all, almost immediately. Simply direct me to upgrade the ship. New request, building 101. Okay, how do I see requests? Do I just talk to him? Talk. Upgrade. Upgrade. And then... Oh, the beginner blueprint. Ah, oh, the exploring krill. The intrepid otter. Ooh. Oh, we can get a mailbox. Okay. Beginner. Purchase. For zero. And then the next upgrade is hobbyist. But we need maple logs and limestone. And 400 of... Whatever those... Whatever that symbol is. I'm not sure what that is. I guess we'll find out soon enough. There you go. You'll be able to build and edit your buildings on your boat. What a treat! But if you really want to upgrade your boat in size and pleasure, I'm your guy. Come back when you feel your boat is getting too crowded. Cheers! <laughs> the little animations really make... really sell the character. The pose and the, the gesturing. Alright, how do we get back to our ship? Go back to this thing. Finally! Good! Ah! Uh, oh my god! I am so sorry! I'm horrible with names. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Good! Aubrey gave it to you for free? And he said he loaned the ship to you? Ominous. Hard to know what he has in mind, but it doesn't sound reassuring. Anyway, let's focus on the task at hand for now. Cleaning up this deck. You can go to your new blueprint table above your cabin and select the move option. In it, you'll be able to remove any building and get back resources. Go for it. I'll wait down here. Is there a way to see... Who's on my ship? Inventory, pause, boat trajectory, and clock. Requests. Cancel, music, interact. Change menu tab. We can glide? We can glide? Jump. Oh. I guess we have to get something later. What else? Cancel. Oh, we can toggle the music, I guess? <gasps> What's this? Oh. Wait, it said music, not... Inventory? And then what's this? And then there. Set sail, Captain. Gwen! There we go. That's how we can see it. Nice. Shenanigans? Oh. 
I have the ability to travel the world now. How nice. Can we get a, uh, a no smoking policy? Is this the blueprint table? This is it, right? Edit. Uh, request advance, set sail, captain. View? What's that? Oh. 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 What is this light? That's some crazy zoom. Doom, 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 doom. All right, edit. Junk pile. Select. Salvage? Are you sure you want to salvage this building? You'll get back the following resources. All stuff I don't have right now. Yes. Nice. Okay, now what? No, we lost our couch. No. Oh. Wonderful. You did a wonderful job, Stella. And the good news is that you have enough resources to add a guest house to your ship. A necessary amenity. Mm -hmm. Newly welcome spirits such as myself will have a temporary space to relax and sleep. Well, sleep? Not really. I can tell you for sure that no one will be thrilled to spend more than one night in there. Mm -hmm. But it beats sleeping on the deck. The stars are pretty, but the wood is stiff and the humidity is hard to tolerate. I'll leave you to it. Have fun. So do I have to... Her happiness went down. Why? I'm doing what you're asking. Oh, I... Build. Is it because we're taking too long? She's impatient. Oh, a cedar? Field. And a garden. Kitchen. Ah, uh, there. The guest house. Build. And then, where should I build it? Far away from me. Keep your cigarette smoke away, please. I'm sorry. But, I'm asthmatic. And I don't want any triggers. Do we find out how they passed? Mm -hmm. Very nice. Mm -hmm. This guest house is very pretty. <laughs> it has your touch. Nice work as usual. Mm -hmm. Now, at last, I have a place to sit down and enjoy the view. Oh! Wait. Mm -hmm. What's going on? Something else is happening. Uh, I should have expected this. I'm actually hungry. Mm. Very hungry. You know how terrible a cook I am. But I remember you being absolutely fantastic at it. Mm. And you might have fished a few fishes already. I got one. I got exactly one. Trouble is, I can't really eat an entire raw fish. I could try for sure, but I'll probably choke on the fishbone and never survive. Mm. That's not how you want me to go. Wait, isn't... She's here already. So she's already passed. So... As absurd as this sounds. <laughs> so you should keep on using this blueprint table of yours and build a kitchen abroad, aboard. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure I've seen the plans for it in there. Mm -hmm. As well as the necessary resources. Yeah. You require bright jelly, mm -hmm. and there's only one way to get some. I... Mm -hmm. Look, I should have told you when he first met you here. Something scares the hell out of me. Mm -hmm. A dark presence. 
and even I cower from it. I avoid that's avoid that swallows all, light included. It can take many forms, and for me, it's always jellyfish. Mm. Yes, I'm fully aware of the irony. The bright jelly you need for the kitchen. Well, only these jellyfish can provide it to you. But there's no other option. It's too dark to navigate. It'll be possible again at dawn. Mm -hmm. I'll have to face my fears. But you're here. Mm -hmm. With you, I can do it. They will appear as a dark patch of pure fear on your map. So you can't miss it. Go. I'll take some time to prepare myself. Mm -hmm. He has something to say again. Ah, yes. I forgot to tell you about this. Hey. As you can see, this boat stops at night. I believe it's a side effect of your Everlight being, well, light. Or some other technicality. Hey. That being said, it will allow people to sleep undisturbed. You, in the meantime, can do anything you want. Tackle unfinished business or just chill in the deck under the stars. I'd suggest you go to sleep too, in that cozy little room atop your cabin. Mm -hmm. You wake up refreshed and ready to go, and the ship will start up again in the morning. Oh, and talking about that, you know me, waking up on time has never been my forte. Mm -hmm. You can ring that big bell over there to wake people- <laughs> That's what that was? That must have been annoying people. Remember, only do it at the right- <laughs> So I can't just mess with the bell from now on. Got it, got it. Mm -hmm. Early morning should do the trick. Speaking of which, time for me to take a nap. See you tomorrow, Stella. Mm -hmm. Have a good night. Good night. Okay. Gwen. Yeah! I got it right. I got her name right. Woohoo! That's... Amazing to me. I'm horrible at names. Uh, what else can we catch? Is it just that for now? Or are we able to catch more stuff? Mm, oh. Come on. Woohoo! It's another herring. Maybe we're just gonna catch herring for now until we go to a new area. Possibly. Sleep into morning? Yes? No? Yes. Oh. This game is super pretty. Oh my gosh. There we go. Time to get up. Good morning! Press R, uh, L1 to toggle the clock and trajectory display on and off. Okay. Good morning! Good morning! <laughs> Relax! You need to calm down with that bell. When you ring it at night, people will get up. Nobody likes to be woken up. Especially me. But it's not night time. It's bell time. Come, watch the sunrise with me. Look at it. It's beautiful. Oh, she uses it as a yo-yo? And then a hacky sack? <laughs> That's really cute. Oh, thank you so much for the follow, Josuke. I'm glad you're enjoying your time here. Um... What did I need to do now? 
Oh yes, we need to go to that new spot. Um, here, right? This is how we do it. It'll be a dark mass, they said. This, I'm guessing? What's this? Crates. Ooh. Treasures. I, this is where we need to go, but I kind of want to, I want to see this. Let's go check it. Definitely. I was gone for a bit as I got a call, which I just finished. That's okay. Welcome back. Um, huh. Oh, we can't stand on that roof. Oh, the jump animation! So cool! <laughs> Look! Mew, mew, mew. I love how the instant reaction to a mission of any kind is to find any and <laughs> any and all possible detours. Yes, I found two so far. <laughs> it's kind of... I think it comes from like years of experience with like gaming and RPGs where if you go directly to your mission, the main mission, you might lose out on the chance to explore. And I want to explore. So far this game is like super calming and relaxing and it's really nice. Makes me want to cry. It's so beautiful. We're crashing into stuff. Oh no! Oh, there's a, a crate? How do we... Oh! There we go. Woohoo! Are there like sea monsters that'll get me? There's barnacles on my ship. Get that off. Oh, I was... <laughs> I was messing around. I didn't think I could actually do it, but yeah. We're clearing the barnacles off. <gasps> we can hug the cat! How did I do that? Wait, how did I do that? How? Ah! I had. So you have to crouch. Crouch and then interact. Okay. A <laughs> pure accident. Oh my. I was trying to clear barnacles and I pressed the wrong button. Whoa! Come on. I was going through a bunch of different people streaming Spare Fairy because I'm mildly obsessed with this game and I've been streaming it as well. Nice! And the moment I decided to stay was the instant you got to move freely, so I decided to make the character. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you like that. <laughs> because when a game has good um, animations, I like observing it in detail. Like the cat rolling around on the water, look at it! <laughs> It's so cute! Okay, um, and now we can go to the mission. Confirm travel. We're gonna get some bright jelly and we can build our kitchen and cook some fish. Can I feed the cat fish? Can we get catnip? Cat serving on a little ball? Yeah. With the, uh, with the look of terror on their face. It's okay. There's gonna be jellyfish, but don't worry. Everything will be alright. Everything will be alright. Hi, hi, Teddy! Welcome to the stream! Hey, um... So, what, did you go affiliate? Yes, I did! 
This is a while ago, actually. The only thing I'm really doing with my affiliate is like channel point redeems. And recently I got Vien to do emotes for me. Uh, I like this one. Because <laughs> I love coffee so much. Thank you. Needed that. Here we are. Damn. Here they come. Remember, set your eyes on the ones with bright jelly. They should be visible enough. That said, pop as many as you can. You'll get glimpses anyway. I'll wait for you inside. It's just too hard for me to stay out here. Okay, go ahead. I believe in you. Okay, what do I... Oh, they're coming from the right. Okay. Aha! Oh no! Yes! Oh, they're gonna be higher. Can I jump onto the uh, on top of that roof? Um, what? No! 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 Come on! What? Yeah! No! No! Yes! No! 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 We gotta go! We gotta go! I miss a lot. It's a big one! I'm gonna miss a few of them. The important ones are the green one, right? That's the... That's the thing for the mission? And then what are the yellow things? Wow, there's a lot of them here! No, 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 no. Is, can I sprint? Can I sprint? How sprint? No! No! Gah! No! Please! Please! Give me back! No! I fell! Ugh. I'm sad. I'm very sad. Can we do that again? Yellow ones are money, green ones are a uh, star jelly or something? I don't remember the name. Oh, so that's the, um... Eh... Glims? The yellow ones are glims? Fantastic! Okay. I'm really impressed. I'm not. I fell off the boat. You rocked out there, rocked off the boat, tumbling and diving like a shooting star, and without the slightest fear nor hesitation at that. You definitely haven't lost your touch, Stella. And you even gathered enough bright jelly to build a proper kitchen. It's called bright jelly, the green things, I I think? Probably. Glims is money, yes. Okay, good to know. Uh, I was short on glims for a few things that I wanted. You fell out the boat and you still probably caught more than I- Really? What? <laughs> I was hoping I could sprint. I'm not sure what button it is to sprint. I'll try to figure that out next. For whenever we go back. Oh, and thanks Teddy for the congrats. Were you- were you on playing music earlier? I think I saw you on earlier. How did it go? Go for it. I'll be patiently waiting. Mm. Slowly digesting myself. <laughs> I'm liking this girl more and more. Is it build? Kitchen! We have six out of three. Build. Can we stack? <gasps> we can stack. Oh! Wait. Let me move the camera. Oh no. 
I can't build on the left side. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. So, would it be better to stack for the, uh, what's it called? For when we need to catch those light things? Stack. Stack them, stack them. It feels like... Yes. But should I... Should I be standing at this point? To catch the glimpse? Stack is good, it gives you a bit more height. Yeah. But should I build it directly on top of each other like this? Or up higher? I think... Yeah, I think I'm gonna do it like this because it's more, um, more aesthetically pleasing. It just looks nicer. I'd go directly on top, otherwise it'd still be tricky to get with the ladder. Oh, okay, okay. Do it. And... The only thing I needed, right? We can make a bench. Jump. Okay, how do I sprint? That's not it, that's not it, that's not it, that's not it. Hop, hop, nope. Those aren't sprint buttons. What's that? Nope. Just interact, jump. There's no sprint, it's just... This is the speed, this is the one speed. Alright. Well, I mean, she's already sprinting, so... I guess that's fine. There is no sprint, just normal running, as far as I'm aware. Okay, that's good to know. Lovely kitchen! You can now use the kitchen's oven. It should be rather simple. Put any one ingredient in the oven and wait for it to be cooked. You could even try um, these loose corn kernels that have been hanging around my pockets. I can't wait to see you in your cooking glory again. You got this. Yeah, I'm liking Gwen a lot more. Uh, here. Look. Recipes. What are the recipes? We don't know any. <laughs> okay, of course we wouldn't. Uh, cook. Cornel. She wanted... What does she want? Fish or... Because she gave us the corn. Did she want us to cook the corn or the fish? Because when we started this mission, she mentioned the fish. Um, let's look at the mission. Mailbox? No. Requests. Cook something. So I guess it didn't matter. Corn is usually good as a start. Alright, we'll try that. Uh, corn. 60 glim? But the herring's 15. Oh, was it worth more? Or do I spend that amount? 30. And... Cook. 3.95. How long does it take? Is it done? Ooh. It's done! Popcorn! Oh, it looks like I burnt it. I can smell it. I could eat anything. Just give me some food. Uh, food. Popcorn! Meal size? Snap. Dish type? Comfort. Well, I won't die just yet. Thanks, Stella. It's better than I thought it could be. But then again, you've always been a wonder in the kitchen. You don't spend. Just worth more. Okay. Alright. I thought it cost Gl uh, Glim to use the stove. Don't forget, spirits don't run on sunshine and water. But our ship does. We need a good meal once in a while. It'll be up to you to understand who's fond of what. As for me, I'm sure you remember I've always loved comfort food. And that I would die for a cup of coffee. Yes! I love Gwen. <laughs> 
But I'm not that picky. I can eat anything. Just never the same thing twice. Oh, and before I forget, here's something I was supposed to give you. I'm not sure exactly how it works, but a noble is a symbol of a passage. It's a fee each spirit has to pay you. But something tells me you already knew that. Mm. Okay, let's keep on improving this craft. As you must have seen, in your blueprint table, there's both a field and a garden blueprint. Mm. Which means you can grow many different things and turn the ship into an adorable farm of sorts. You should add a field first in my opinion. Mm -hmm. It's going to be easier to find the resources for it around here and you can grow linen in it. Which in turn will be used to craft more things. In addition to building a field, we should go buy seeds to mm -hmm. use in it. But that'll come later. I need you to visit an island close by. It's called Mustang Cove. Mustang? Mustang? And there's something in it we need. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you when we get there. Hooray! We did it. We did it. Should we fish? Do we need to eat? Or are we immortal? Hmm. Seeds for the future. Do I do that now? Can I do that now? Build a field! Okay, let's see if I can do that now. Build a field. We are immortal. I don't even think Stella can eat. Okay. Built. It'd be nice if we could eat. Just for RP purposes. Build. And then field. Oh, we're gonna need material. We don't have material. Alright. To bed. Ho, ho, ho. Sleep until morning? Yes. Good morning! How come I can't... Come on. There. No. There. No. Oh, it won't let us do it in there. Okay, fine. Good morning! <laughs> So nice. Oh, it looks like it's gonna be an overcast day. Well, that's fine. Alright, where do we need to go? Oh, Gwen's not up yet. Okay. Uh, let's check the map. You can also ring the bell to wake up the passengers on the boat. Yeah, but she didn't like that. And we don't have coffee yet, so let's not wake her up. Up here? Ooh. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's go grab resources and then head up to the cove. Confirm travel. Bum, 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 boom, ba, ba. Boing, boing, boing. What? What? <laughs> Show your moves. Shoot. Can we go in? She sleeps standing up. What the heck? Mr. Sandman. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Woohoo! Oh, there's the crate. 
Where? <gasps> no, what's that? What's that? Give me. Go down and press X. Down, X. We got it. What's that? Limestone. Ooh. Is there anything else? Just the crate. No. Oh. Yay. Oh, there's something else over here. Dive. Dive. Nice. Copper ore. I think that's our first one, actually. Oh, Gwen's up. Good morning, Gwen. Good morning. Good morning. Sorry, no coffee yet. Are we gonna get coffee beans? Is that what we're going there for? Don't ask me how, but I've met Albert already. He definitely is a shark. But his interest in all things maritime will be helpful. Such as the boat upgrades he sells at an outrageously high- What? He said it was a small fee- What? With those, you'll be able to cross ominous water- Whoops. Ominous weather barriers in the world. They look like classical mythical challenges again. A bit cliche if you ask me. Woohoo! Alright, time to move on. Uh, door. And then that. And then up here. Confirm travel. Oh, is that the progress bar for our travel? On the top left? Ah. I'll do some fishing. <coughs> Fish, fish, fish. Oop. What we get? What we get? A boot? <laughs> what can we do with boots? Hopefully, catch one more boot. We'll make a pair. We got one. Pairing! Another herring. I think we're just going to be getting herrings. Um, um, um. Look at the bird. <gasps> the light! The light! It shines! What is this? What's this light? What is this? Touch. 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 Cannot touch. Hmm. I can't interact with it. What? The light is just there to signal you're coming in or going out of bl Oh, okay, like a lighthouse. Look at that. Master and Cove discovered. Okay. Does this pause the game? I think it does. I hope it does. I'm going to grab a drink. Uh, we'll take a short break. A short five minute break. But yes, I'll see you guys in a bit. I like how my, my background matches our first character.
I wonder when we'll be able to glide. Um, oh, something I didn't try using was the boat trajectory. Um, L1? Oh, okay, so it's that. Okay, just some HUD elements. Look at that! We should hop on that island over there. Maybe we'll find something interesting. Seeds for the future. Request advanced. Onward! Adventure awaits! Oh! Oh, what's this? Can we touch? Touch. Oh, oh, did we just steal this person's stuff? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Here we go. What a majestic tree. Well, you can cut it down. Yes, it's fine. I promise. That's the best way to get the wood you need, actually. But don't worry. They'll regrow over time. How much time? Another interesting fact about the Everlight. What? What's going on? Oh! Oh, look at the... <laughs> the, yeah, the she's trying her best. <laughs> well done. Congratulations. For you have become death, the destroyer of worlds. Joke aside, that's how you do it. You go on ahead, cutting down more trees. Then we can go back to the boat and build the field with all those maple logs. I'll be on the next raft. Whoops. I'll be next to the raft. Deforestation, here we come. Can we touch the bush? Ooh. Raspberries. Nice. Bum 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 ba da ba There's a tree. Chop. Ready? Go! Ooh. 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 Is there anything hidden there that we can get? Maybe if we swim. Down. Down. Dive. No. Oh. Dive. Ah, there's nothing hidden. Do, 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 do. All right. I thought there would be something hidden there. Was that it? Was that the was that the last one? <gasps> the rock. Hold square as long as possible to break a mining node. Oh, too long. <laughs> that animation from failure was pretty cool. Take one. Mood. 
Favorite food? Black coffee. Likes? Comfort food and question mark. Dislikes? Hmm, we have to figure it out. Uh, slightly positive. She's hungry. Oh. Shops for fibers? Hmm. Food. What kind of food do I have for you? Raspberries. Hmm. Let's try this. Hmm. No. Sorry, Stella. You know I can't eat fruit for the life of me. I've tried, but I just can't. Ah, uh, okay, fine. Fine! Have it your way. How do I see that? How do I see what she likes? Without going all the way over to her. Is that possible? A bottle filled with a considerable bottle considerable amount of glimpse. Nice. Should I open it now? Hmm. I should cook some fish for her. Never the same thing twice. Uh, here. Cook. Tick, 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 tick. She was calling. What's up? Oh, she has a picture of us up in here. I didn't notice that before. Wait, what's going on? What's happened? There's like a constellation? Let's see what it is. I'm getting goosebumps. Oh no, did we overcook it? Is it overcooked? Is it possible to burn it? Grilled fish. Haha. -ha. Nice. Is it possible to mix stuff? Mm. What if we put fish and mu muscle? Muscle? Cannot. More fish. What if we do two fish? What happens? Alright, while we're waiting for that, let's go and do the quest thingy. They wanted us to make a field. Which is that one? Yeah, this one. Build. Oh, it fits perfectly right here. Build. It was meant to be. Oh, she's sleeping. Oh, it's still running. Oh. 
We'll go catch more herrings. I'm assuming we'll eventually find a way to catch more stuff. <clears throat> I think one more and we'll go check the stove. Oh, it tells us when it's done. Oh. Oh, it just... It just gives us multiple. Alright. Cool. Oh, we can go inside. Alright. And then... Ooh! <gasps> Plant coffee bean seeds. And then... Sprout into flax, which in turn can be woven into linen thread. Oh! One of these... And then... Yeah, let's make some coffee beans. Can make some coffee for us. Coffee for Gwen. How long does it take? Sleep in the morning? Yes. We're done for today. For today. Good night. Does the light shut off? Oh, it just fades to black. Good morning. Let's check on the garden. Is it the garden? No, the field. Nothing yet. We water it! Oh. Okay. Nice. <laughs> Good morning, Gwen. Time to get up. Hey. A field. Yep, I took care of it last night. Hey. Huh. It's better looking than I thought. There's a little je ne sais quoi to it. Simple, but elegant. Hey. Now, all you have to do is plant field seeds in there. Seeds can grow only in their respective places. Garden seeds won't grow in the field, so don't bother trying. But you know me, I would kill a plastic cactus, so don't take my word on <laughs> I know, I know quite a few people who would kill a plastic cactus. <laughs> anyway, there's only one place where we could possibly find what we need. Theodore specializes in seeds. He has set up shop in Hummingbird, the busiest part of the area, busiest town of the area. Theodore and his brothers are the founders of Raccoon Inc., a shady retail franchise with very loose moral values. Yes, this world has a serious problem of dubious business practices. Since I don't want to get swindled, I'll come with you and do most of the talking. Since I don't want you to get swindled, 
I'll come with you and do most of the talking. I've run into this cheeky little raccoon once, and his dishonesty was blatant. Let's head to Hummingbrake then. Hey. We just need to find some seeds for that field. But I've already, I've already planted it. When? When what do I do? I planted it already. You know, I'm delighted that you're here with me. But I'm not surprised one bit. It adds up. You here? Taking care of me in my final hours? You've always cared so damn much about others. Always protected those you found vulnerable. Even pedantic snobs like me. Remember the day my father yelled at the cat? We just got out of elementary school. You were wearing those blue sneakers with the glittery tags. And there you were, yelling back at my father like you were on a mission. Mm. Father turned red and smashed a pur purple Delano vase. It was rad. <laughs> we pissed him off that much. What's your mood right now? Ah, uh, neutral. Hungry. Uh, let's try giving you the fish. We click this. Do you like it? Thanks, I love it. Nice. Good morning. Thank you. Okay, time to head off to that new place, whatever the place was she mentioned. Uh huh. <gasps> More treasures. <gasps> More glim. Ooh. Should we go there? No, 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 no. <gasps> More glim. More. Ooh. There's a lot more. All right. Uh, let's go here for. <laughs> let's go here first. No. Wait, are we gonna go through the that field? Will it bring us through it? Hmm. I hope it does. That way I can just hop off the boat and grab the material. Chill. No, 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 no. Chill. Give me the shell. Yes. Crate should be coming up. There it is. Drop. Fine. Yeah. And dive. Copper. And one more. Dive. There's a lot of shells on my ship. Keep it clean, keep it clean. Any more? No, we're good. Nice. Shoop, shoop, shoop. Can we fish from this end? Or is it only from the back? Oh, I think Shay would love this game. I'll try to convince her to play it, to stream it. I just like watching the idle, idle animations. Oh, we're here!
Gwen, look! It's the place! With the swindlers! Hummingbird discovered. Here, let's buy some seeds. Theodore has set up shop on this island. Let's pay him a visit. Forward. Are those berries? Can we collect those? No. Oh, hello. Oh. I'm out here looking for the right house to start a family. My wife sent me out to find some something that might fit our needs. A garden. Maybe a pool. Ah, okay, so we need a garden and a pool to be able to take him on? Mm -hmm. I'm not asking for much. I just can't decide. I know that you can't help me, but it helps to say mm -hmm. it out loud. I might stumble on the rarest finds. There's another one. Yeah, I hope my next game will be ready soon. I've crunched the data and spent five nights theory crafting. Clearly, if you take the heavy weapon proficiency from the Mountain Gnome race, there is a nifty synergy with the level 3 rogue ability Eviscerate. Mm. It's for sure a bit weird, but hey, 5d20 and auto crit on prone can't be defeated, am I right? <laughs> She's talking my language. It's D&D! <laughs> mm. A stroll a day keeps the doctor away, which reminds me, I haven't been to the doctor in forever. Mm. Oh no, why did I think about health all of a sudden? Am I suddenly starting to feel unwell? Mm. I'm not sick, I'm okay. Oh, mm. take, a go take a good look at the shrine, Stella. It's simply stunning. Some objects in this world are meant to resonate with the spirit fair and the Everlight. Mm -hmm. I've heard this monument has the power to enhance the Everlight's abilities. Mm -hmm. The two slots in it need to be filled up. I'm fairly certain you could use obols to activate it. But to get obols, you need to welcome more spirits on your ship. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you'll soon find more lost souls like me. Like these people around? Can we take all of them on? Double jump! Ooh! I need to take on at least one more person. Oh, so is this where we get the glide as well? Interesting. I simply adore your hat! Oh, thank you. Our local shop, Raccoon Inc., only carries garbage wares. Seeds, logs, rocks, all useless items. I need me a hat like yours. Good. Oh, it's, a, it's an actual raccoon! <laughs> There's Theodore. Go ahead, take a look at what he's selling. Hello, sir. Key for Hummingbird. Wait, is this what he's... Huh? So this is what I have. And this is what they have. Hello! Step right up, potential prospects. Welcome to Raccoon Inc. We've been servicing Hummingbird since forever. You've got the glims, I've got the goods, I've got all the wares to make you spend those hard-earned glims. Step right up. <laughs> Alright, buddy. Those prices are out of control. I won't let him get away with this. Are you ready to see me obliterate this merchant? Um... Sure. Good. Let's do this. Theodore. I know what you're doing here, and you should be ashamed of yourself, you trash man. <laughs> mm. 
People like you are the reason we have middle. <laughs> Gwen! Gwen, what the heck? What? <laughs> what? Madam, what is the meaning of this? My friend here is the new spirit fairer, but she's not a newbie, and neither am I. That little scam of yours won't work on us, but I. I can assure you, my business practices are quite above board. Mm. Be warned, you treacherous striped weasel. I won't tolerate this behavior one more second. No more shenanigans. No more double crosses. Mm. Just fair prices. Mm. I... Mm. So stop being dishonest at once. And next time I see you, I'll try being nicer. If you start being smarter. Mm. Got it? Mm. But... Yes. Yes, of course. I promise you, I'll adjust my prices. I beg you, please don't scold me anymore. I'll even give you a discount. <laughs> hey, you. Yes, you. Your friend really gave that greedy merchant some help. You both look like you could possibly join the upstairs crew. <laughs> what? You want to come up, don't you? I can see it in your eyes. I'm not going to lie, it's pretty cool being up here. Yeah, all the best people are up here. Don't get too excited though. Some idiot broke the ladder. You'd have to be able to jump inhumanly high to make it. I guess you could also use the stairs in that house. But some other idiot lost the key. Well, anyway, see ya. Upstairs crew forever. <laughs> I like these characters. Oh, you could do it with double jump. Upstairs crew! Get the key. Um, is it this? We need 5,000. Oh, seeds! Linen, corn, coffee beans, carrots! Let's buy some carrots. <gasps> Whoa! I spent a lot just now. I didn't mean to. Turnips! Hooray! Fantastic! Yeah. If you got everything you need, I'll take my leave. Feel free to stay here as long as you want. I'll meet you at the pier. No, I need more. I need more glim. I'll beat you there! Goodbye! <laughs> Whoops! I did it! We beat her here. How do we save? Oh, it's a save and quit thing. But yeah. I think I am going to be ending it here for today. We, I feel like I did quite a bit. But yeah, I'm loving this game so far. It's super calming, super relaxing, super sweet. The graphics, I love the graphics, I love the animations. The characters are all super cute. Gwen is starting to grow on me. She's hilarious. And she's a coffee lover. <laughs> but yeah, we'll go ahead and end it there. Uh, Josuke, thank you again for the follow. And Teddy Gamer, thank you so much for stopping by. Atax, th thank you so for, uh, for stopping by. And I hope to see you guys again next time. Goodbye.